Okay, that was loud as hell. Hope you guys are all doing quite well. Sorry, that moth was driving me crazy. So, anyway, this right here is Cast of the Seven. I couldn't even read that. <laughs> Cast of the Seven Godsons. And I'm going to turn off. Or at least turn. Turn that down. That is loud as hell. Now, uh, Cast of the Seven Godsons is actually uh, loosely based off of, at least inspired by um, games you might recognize here, which I'll let it play in the background while I'm cleaning off the goo off my finger from a dead moth. But anyway, uh, basically this is based off of games you might know of, of Ghosts and Goblins and whatever else. So, go ahead and start this up. It has, um, basically, it doesn't look amazing. It looks decent, but that's about it. Again, it's an independent game, so it's like I can't quite expect, like, thrills and shrills everywhere. Make sure you uh, add the file numbers so that way it adds to the effect of the game. Okay. A is to attack and B is to jump. Okay, I get that much. So far, it's all right. I'm trying not to talk too much because I won't be able to focus. But... You can attack in up direction and down direction, which is pretty cool. Wow. Okay. So you do get to keep armor and everything. Not armor, but weapons. This guy apparently throws marshmallows. There you go. I should have done it that way. So far, so far, pretty much has ability, like um, a lot of secrets to it, which is pretty cool. Oops. Apparently transform into something too, which is pretty cool.
Rock Eye 2 OP. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a cat person. No, I'm just a random person this person got fan service about and decided to add into the game. Oh, okay. Suck ass! Ah! Fuck you, I don't care! That's one pissed pig. Okay, rock steady. Oh! Rock City was playing for keeps. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. I mean, the game isn't bad. Like, I don't hate it. It's just the graphics kind of put me off a little bit. But again, I appreciate what the developer has at least done with the game. Like, it doesn't feel like anything that's terrible. Like, the gameplay makes up for the graphics a little bit. I mean, the graphics, again, aren't horrible. Let me get that clear. It's just... Mm. Uh So you get two life bars for each piece of armor. This thing's a secret over there, but... Oh, get I like that sword. There. Get rid of that real fast. Oh, I got. What the? Wait, what? Oh, I like this. Ooh. Spread shot. G. 
Jesus Christ! I don't like it anymore. <laughs> that took a week and a fucking all day. A lot of effort though behind the platforming in this so far. It's executioner. That was needed. Yep, I definitely need a new piece of gear pretty soon. Oh my god! <laughs> Come on, bitch. You can do it. Alright, here we go. Controls aren't bad either. They're actually pretty decent. You know, anything I fuck up on is on me. Like that. Like, I totally fucked up. Uh, let's see what I got here. Oh, you... You motherfucker! Right. Higher jump. Alright. Like, it feels like they at least put the effort behind the controls to keep them tight. Oh man, I, yeah, I couldn't. But yeah, that's the game in a nutshell. If you like it, be sure to pick it up. It's in the bundle that I'll put down in the comment down below. Take it easy.